What's going on everyone? In this video, I'm bringing you guys some jailbreak news regarding the Apple TV fourth generation. I'm doing this video as quick as I can in order to give people a chance to do this before it is too late. So I do apologize if I make any mistakes, I will make sure to correct them in the description. If you have been following development on this, you would have noticed some tweets by Nito TV which give us a lot of hope of a tvOS 10.1 jailbreak. Nito TV is actually really famous in the Apple TV jailbreaking world, so he is very much trusted. I'm gonna go ahead and read some of these tweets to give you an idea. Basically, he's like, there's still a tough road ahead. tvOS is still the neglected stepchild at Apple, and in jailbreak scene, we'll do my best to help change that. And my time to devote is limited. During first tvOS jailbreak at the beginning, I was still unemployed. Now my job obviously takes precedence. We'll try to put in some solid work this weekend, but I'm really excited at potential to jailbreak when a firmware version can still be installed and mass by people. Get on 10.1 if you aren't jailbroken already. So you pretty much want to go ahead and jump to 10.1 if you are on anything older. And if you are on 10.1.1, you want to go ahead and downgrade to 10.1 by checking out the link in the description, selecting Apple TV, then you select Apple TV 4, and you download tvOS 10.1. You want to do this as quick as you can because if you wait too long, you may not be able to downgrade or update due to Apple closing the signing window. Always check the description where I will say if it's still possible or not, so just look out for that. Make sure to check out my tutorial for upgrading or downgrading your Apple TV OS software. But basically, this is what it's going to look like. You can then hit OK and unplug your Apple TV from your computer. You can go ahead and plug it into your TV and follow through the setup process. Once you are finished, you want to go over to the settings. Select General, then select About. Here, make sure your tvOS version is 10.1. Then you want to go back and select System. Here, you want to go to Software Updates. Make sure Automatically Update is off to prevent any accidental updates. And that's pretty much all you need to do. You can go ahead and sit tight and wait for a possible jailbreak to come out. If you ever get a message asking you to update, just select update later every time you get that because otherwise it might accidentally update and you're stuck without a jailbreak. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope that I was clear enough on this and that you found this information helpful. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you guys in the next video.